Hello guys, in this video I am going to show you how to make secret knock door lock. Here I am using a solenoid lock. To unlock this we have to knock in our secret pattern. It is unlocked for 5 seconds and again locked. If we knock in wrong pattern then Secret knock failed. This is our right one. So today we are going to see this. So let's get started. For this we need Arduino 16 by 2 LCD display, potentiometer for this display. A speaker, this speaker will provide the knock signal to the Arduino. Then we need red LED, green LED, a switch to change the pattern. With this LED we need a resistor for both the LED. These are 220 ohms. The switch is connected to D11 of Arduino. With the D11 we have to connect a 10 kilo ohms resistor it will be connected to the ground. This is positive connection. This 5 volt is connected to potentiometer, the LCD display and the LED. The display LED and this is our negative connection. The negatives are connected to the ground. 220 ohms resistor is connected to negative pin of the LED. It is display LED. Middle pin of the potentiometer should be connected to the VEE pin of LCD. The speaker pin is connected to A0 pin of Arduino. Across the speaker we have to connect 1 mega ohms resistor. D2 pin of Arduino is connected to RS pin of LCD. D3 to enable pin. D4 to D4. D5 to D5. D6 to D6. And D7 to D7. Positive pin of red LED is connected to A4 green LED to A5. Now we need 12 volt battery, a relay module and solenoid lock. The 12 volt supply is connected to Arduino. It is connected to V in and, and this 12 volt is also connected to normally open pin of relay module. These are negative connection. The negative pin of the battery is connected to the ground pin of Arduino and to the solenoid lock and with the negative pin of relay module. This is positive. The signal pin of the relay module is connected to D12 of Arduino and the common pin of the relay is connected to positive pin of the solenoid lock. So this is our connection. Now we will make this circuit on breadboard. Arduino Nano, 10 kilo ohms potentiometer, push button switch, 10 kilo ohms resistor, 220 ohms resistor, green and red LED, a solenoid lock, it is 12 volt solenoid lock, a speaker, across the speaker I have soldered an 1 mega ohms resistor, 16 by 2 LCD display and a high trigger relay module. This has 3 pins, this pin is signal, the middle pin is positive, we have to connect here 5 volt and this one is ground. This is high trigger relay module. Ok, so these are the thing we need. And for the power supply I am using 12 volt battery. This is 12 volt battery. Ok. Now let's see the connection on breadboard. Putting Arduino Nano, green LED, red LED, push button switch, potentiometer for the display and here is the display. 5 volt pin of Arduino is connected to positive rail, ground is connected to the negative rail, one pin of the switch is connected to the positive rail, with the other pin we have to connect 10 kilo ohms resistor and it is connected to the ground. 
connecting 220 ohms resistor with the negative pin of the LED. One side of the pin of potentiometer is connected to the positive rail. With the other side, we have to connect to the negative rail. VSS of display is connected to the negative rail. VDD to positive rail. V0 pin is connected to middle pin of the potentiometer. RW pin of display is connected to the negative rail. Anode pin of display LED is connected to the positive rail. And cathode pin is connected to the negative rail through 220 ohms resistor. Red LED is connected to A4 and green LED is connected to A5. The switch is connected to D11. Now it's time to connect display to the Arduino. RW pin to D2. Enable pin to D3. D4 to D4. D5 to D5. D6 to D6. And D7 to D7. Now we have to connect the speaker. One request, please consider to subscribe my channel. This will motivate me to make more videos. Thank you. Connecting the negative pin to the ground and positive pin to A0 pin of Arduino. Now I'm connecting the relay module. This will be signal pin. It is positive and ground. Positive and negatives are connected to positive and negative rail and the signal pin should be connected to D12 of Arduino. Now it's time to connect the solenoid lock. This is 12 volt battery. Negative pin of the solenoid lock is connected to negative pin of battery. Here you can see this is how it works. The positive pin of the battery will be connected to the normally open pin of relay module and positive pin of the solenoid lock is connected to common pin of relay module. Relay connection is done. Now connect this connection carefully. This is 12 volt supply and we have to connect this to V in pin of Arduino. And ground pin of the battery to the ground rail. To insert a pattern, you have to press the switch and knock your pattern new lock start now to unlock this you have to knock on the speaker it is unlocked it is unlocked for 5 second and locked if I knock in wrong pattern Secret knock failed. This is the correct one. See, it works. So this is how you can make this project using solenoid lock. So guys, this is all for today. I hope you like this video. If so, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any doubt on this, then please let me know in the comment section. In the next video, I'll show you another topic. Till then, stay happy and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.